Purchase your tracks today. What block are you repping? Which hill won't you step in? You still use a weapon? What religion you bless? What country you flex? How much money you get? Does this song have a message? Do you live for the future, the past, or the present? Now what rights are you pledging? Is it money, your knowledge, your preference? Uh, money, 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 gotta get it. So much money on my mind, it cloud my vision. Money, money, money on and popping. If I need it badly, man, ain't no stopping. What is going on, y'all? How y'all doing today, man? This is Salon Boy Brick, aka Brick the Lyricist, and you are tuned into Onassis Gamings. We are back with another one. You already know what time it is, man. It's music video reaction time. And today, I brought an artist that I have, I've done a lot of uh, his, his tracks. I know you can see it on that screen. I know you're looking at it, man. You ain't looking at me. You're looking at that screen. So, I've done a lot of Millsy. I've uh, probably done maybe like four tracks of Millsy's, and I did one that he did with Jadakiss, man. Jadakiss is a fucking legend. Why didn't I say Jadakiss? I'm just, I'm sorry, y'all. I'm digressing about a, uh, 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 about a, uh, um, a conversation I had before about legends. Jada Kiss, D Block, that, those are fuck. They're legends. You know what I'm saying? We talking about the whole D Block squad. You know what I mean? Chic, Styles P, Jada Kiss. But anyway, man, let me stop digressing. I apologize about that. Today I have for you a song by Millsy featuring Ogisi. Uh, it's called Clear Time. Um, as always, man, you already know. We give it an overall rating. From one to four, you know, one four being the best, one being the worst. Not even the worst, but just the, the you know, least favorite. And then, you know, we rated off of four different categories. We're talking flows, wordplays, punchlines, and multiples, man. So you already know how we're going to rock out. We're going to do what we do. And then we're going to come back. If anything catches my attention while I'm going in the song, I will stop it and I will talk. But other than that, I mean, we're going to play it straight through. We're going to catch what we catch, and then we're going to come back, and then we're going to review it, man. So let's rock, man. You already know Salon Boy. Yeah. Ice cold, big splash, and the lead time. Make back, triple black, I'm on lead time. Ball status, I ain't never been on weird time. Fucking you for hours, I could clear time Back of the ghost, all this water on me, holy A stick protect this ice like a goalie Can't tell me that you loyal, gotta show me Can't tell me that you loyal, gotta show me A band of Cubano Wait, hold on That was bars already, man He said the stick protect the ice like a goalie Ooh, that the was, that was nice. El Hefe, the Hancho, the Marcy, a loud day Bussy on the wrist for my whole team Walk up in the function, make the whole screen yeah. She told me flip over poolside in the mansion I don't even gotta move cause my watch dance All my diamonds do with chocolate All my diamonds do with chocolate Free my shots, cop the crew switch Freeing up my roster, I got new bitch Swimming with piranhas, gotta move vicious Swimming with piranhas, gotta, yeah I'm out in Vegas, 5,000 on the night She gotta be a porn star to excite me She said she like it when I choke her cause she fights me Running up a check in these white nights yeah. Ice cold, big splash, and the lead time Make back, triple black, I'm on lead time Ball status, I ain't never been on weird time Fucking you for hours, I could clear time Back of the ghost, all this water on me, holy a Stick protect this ice like a goalie can't tell me that you loyal, you gotta show me. Can't tell me that you loyal, you gotta show me. Got a brand new Rolly with a chocolate face. Got a thick chocolate bitch, she don't gotta waste. My fucker in the club, I don't wanna wait. Stars in the ceiling, like we had a space. All my bitches make it clap, just like Petty Cake. All my bitches make it clap, just like Petty Cake. I can tell you wanna fuck by how you looking at me. I'm about to turn 30, might be a sugar daddy. The homie half of my age, and he trigger happy. Pop me a perky, I get really nasty. 360 cameras parking in reverse. Run up on this truck, you gon' leave in a hearse. Really trap, I take a brick, you want a verse. Praying for the best, but I expect the worst. Bust a brick open and I expect the work. My bitch don't hesitate, she keep it in the purse. Yeah. Ice cold, big splash, and the lead time. Make back, triple black, I'm on lead time. Ball status, I ain't never been on weird time. Fucking you for hours, I could clear time. Back of the ghost, all this water on me, holy. A stick protect this ice like a goalie. Can't tell me that you loyal, you gotta show me. Can't tell me that you loyal, you gotta show me. Okay. Alright. Alright. 
me? Hey, you gotta like, man. Millsy. All right, so I'm a. All right, let me let me let me say this. The beat, I love the beat. Millsy always killing it, man. His, his punchlines and the way his clarity of his verses are amazing. I love it. Ogeezy, I don't know who you are, but you definitely got to work on your flow, kid. Like, and your delivery, meaning your punchlines. She clap it like patty cake. Was not bad. It was not a bad bar, but everything else after that was like I think that was the only bar that actually stuck out. That was actually really good. Everything else was not. Uh, I don't know, man. See, if this was just. All right, all right, all right. Hold on, hold on. Because this is what I'm kind of I'm thinking. I'm I'm assuming. I'm guessing this one right here. This is a guess. This is a guess. All right, this is a guess. This is an assumption. You know what I'm saying so. I'm probably making an ass out of me and you. Or you and me, however you want, however you want to spell assume, uh, assume. But this is an assumption. I'm assuming that Millsy or these artists that are a little bit like indie and all of that are hitting up Millsy and actually paying him to do verses with him or doing tracks with him. It could be the other way around. It could be the other way around. But this is what I'm assuming. Because a lot of these artists, it was another artist that he did a track with. And when I tell you Millsy killed the flow and killed the vibe and killed the beat. And then the other artist just came in and butchered it. Like, he just straight fucked it up for me. Like, you see how I'm listening to Millsy? I'm like, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's it. And then that's when the bull come in. Like, why you start your bars off like that? Why you ain't stay on beat and actually flow and vibe this shit so right, man? Like, you just threw my whole head bobbing off. Like, you know what I'm saying? I started going like this. Then you come in and I got to go like, what the fuck? Like, what are you what are you doing, dog? Like, you know what I'm saying? But I don't know, man. And here's the thing. When you when I rate these, I rate it as a collective. So him having Ogisi on that really brought the rating down. If I was the rated just by Millsy yourself, I think it would have had a little bit of a higher a better higher rating. Because I already know the second verse, he would have fucking murdered it. He would have killed it. He would have been doing exactly what he was doing, hitting it with the flow, rocking it. He's consistent with the flow. So that what kind of hurts Millsy a little, um, uh, Mil Millie's, Millie's. I call it, keep calling this nigga Millsy. Millie's a, a, a lot. You know what I'm saying? Because he's consistent with the flow. His flow doesn't change. So when you have that consistency in the flow, I normally don't give you a higher rating for that because for me, having flow is being able to go in and switch it up, challenge yourself, slow it down when they don't expect it, pick it up when they don't expect it, flip it around, say something different. Like, it's really like, dude, the flow has to be not constant. When it's constant, you get a constant rating. You know what I'm saying? The boy itself. All right, all right. First off, let me let me, let me me give y'all the overall, because I, I, I can sit here all day and really dissect this whole track, but we ain't going to do that. So overall, I gotta give this track a three out of four. It's not a fire track. It's not like it's not. A, I don't think it's a banger banger, but this shit is definitely fire. This is a good ass track. Remember, you get it's a, a um. I like the track for one. It's a good track for two. It's a good ass track for three, and this shit's a banger for four. You know what I'm saying? This wasn't a banger track, in my opinion. Yeah, 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 exactly, yep. Yeah. But um, yeah, yeah, he definitely does study Jada, man. He definitely does. You could tell because Jada, Jada got the same type of bars, the consistent flow, and dropping it and hitting it just like that. Oh damn, you give it a two? All right, fat fifty fifty half a man. And, and I and but see, I think I know why your rating went down like that. It went down because Ogisi. You know what I'm saying? I mean, Drew, I think your rating went down because of because of the young boy, the young boy that came in after him, he kind of brought down the momentum and the energy. Because when Mill, Mill, um, Millie started off, he actually was he was vibing. Like I, I caught on that hook. I'm like, oh, you heard me when he as soon as he said, uh, um, the stick protect the ice like a goalie. I'm like, oh, hold on, I had to pause that shit and really listen. I'm like, oh, what the fuck. This shit is actually a nice bar. And then he come in with his verses, and his verses just hitting, his punchlines hitting. He really knocking it up. And then that's when he hit him with the hook again, and then the ball come in, and he just fuck it up. And then that's when the hook come back in, then you vibing again, and then the, the song is over. And then after that, you left wondering, like, what the fuck just happened? Like, what the fuck just happened? 
You know what I'm saying? So that's what we were stuck with. So I can understand why you're giving it a... I can understand why you're giving it a... Uh, you're giving it a two. I'm giving it a three on the fact that it was... Um, I really I really fucked with the beat. It was definitely a unique type of beat, something that stood out to me. And that type of beat right there is what gives... What what I like. I fuck with that type of beat. You know what I'm saying? I can't, I can't say I hate it. Um, come on. It's the wrong time to call me, shorty. All right, my bad, y'all. My bad, y'all. Okay, somebody calling my phone. All right, so yeah, I'm gonna, I, I got, I got to give it an overall three. I'm gonna give it a three because I like the beat. I like the video somewhat, even though they're just standing in the same places all day, just hanging around bitches. You know what I'm saying? And then, um, I, I kind of like, Mil, uh, I love uh, Millie's version. Yo, what the fuck, bro? Like, stop calling me. Um, uh, yeah. So, uh, and I like Millie's, Millie's verse. So we, we leave it at that. Um, now let's get right into the ratings, man. So the flow wise, because it was so consistent. <laughs> he is though. I, I'm not, a, I said, I ain't, I, I, no, I ain't, I'm not, I'm not, a. I'm not denying that. No, she wants to talk about. She wants to talk about the person that's calling me. Actually, wanted to get into a discussion about male and females, because um, I was telling her today at work. I was telling her today at work that um, because she was saying, hold up, um, hold on, let me finish this real quick, and I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm gonna hit you up with that because I'm kind of still recording for YouTube and all of that. We're gonna get right into that. All right, so, so when it comes to the uh, when it comes to the um, the flow, I'm gonna give the flow. I'm going to give the flow. See, I, I'm going to give it a five. I really want to give it, and I'm giving it like 5.5, honestly. If I had to be honest, realistic about it, I'm giving it like 5.5. But I'm not going to round up because Ogisi really fucked the track up for me. Like, if if Mil, if Millie's was the only one that was on this track, I think I would have given it a seven. You know what I mean? He's consistent with the flow. He doesn't change it up and anything like that. But the way he's so consistent with it makes his punchlines and his wordplay stand out so much better. You know what I'm saying? So, but I'm going to give it a five. I'm going to give it a five. Because remember, I'm, I'm, I'm rating it as a collective. This is including all the artists that's in there. Everything that they're saying from the ad-libs to the, to the raps itself. But the flow-wise, just the flow itself, Millsy would have got like a six and then, or he would have got like a seven and, um... Ogisi would have got like a three. So if you average that out, it's about like five or something like that. You know. So I'm gonna give it, I'm gonna give it a five. Uh wordplay wise, I'm probably gonna give that one. I'm gonna give it a five also. I'm gonna give that one a five also. I mean, his wordplays wasn't bad. Mill Millie's had good wordplay, but you remember you have to judge everyone as a collective. I'm not breaking them down individually because I'm giving you the whole collective as a whole track. So I'm going to probably say overall, it's a five also. Multiples. Because it's so consistent with the multiples, the rhyme and N-words. And, 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 and you can tell he got the Jadakiss flow because Jadakiss, when, when Jadakiss rap his N-words, he always rhymes at least like four to six bars or four to eight bars before he switches it up again. Normally he rhymes he rhymes four bars, four bars, four bars, four bars. That's sixteen, and you get like four different rhymes in that. Uh, so I'm gonna get, damn, I'm gonna give that one a five also. We had fifteen right now. I'm really trying. My, I'm trying my hardest. I'm really thinking about this, but you know, it's like when Millsy's when Millie's is giving me high ratings, Ogisi's coming in and giving me low ratings, and it's averaging out to be what it is. It's not a bad track to me. I think it's a good ass track, but I probably only listen to the hook in the first verse, and after that, I cut that shit off. I might, if I if I forget to skip that shit, listen to Ogisi's part again. But that's only because I'm waiting for the hook to come back in. That's my opinion. So I'm gonna give I'm gonna give the multiples a five also, and then the punchlines. I will give the punchlines. I will give the punchlines. I will give the punchlines a six. I will give it a six. It wasn't. I'll give it a six. 
and I'm, and I'm really contemplating about that because I don't even know if a six is even good enough for that. You know what I'm saying? But I'll give it a six. Five, 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 fifteen, six, twenty-one. Twenty-one out of forty for Millie's and Ogisi. Clear time, man. This is Salon Boy Brick, aka Brick Deliverance. Oh, Nasus Gamings. I thank you guys for tuning in to this video in its entirety. Do not forget to dream big, play hard, live good, stay blessed, stay humble, stay focused, man. You know, don't 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 let anybody tell you you can't do shit. You know what I'm saying? As long as you're alive every day, you take a brick and you lay it on top of that mansion that you are trying to build. Every day, take a brick, take a step forward on that road to success, man. That's all you have to take. Do not compare yourself to whatever everybody else is doing. You mean you might have friends, you might have family, you might have people, enemies that are doing way better than you right now. It does not mean you will never get to that uh, position. It does not mean that they will always be in that position. You just keep pushing for how you want to move, where you want to be, and you stay focused on your goals and you keep on pushing, man. Never tie yourself out and um, never lose hope in yourself, in your family. And in God, man, you know how we move, man. Salon boy, peace. I love you guys. Thank you.